Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Asylum Challenge. Um, I have to admit that I am quite dumb because I loaded in my game today. This is episode 25, and I just realized that B is sitting on this picnic table and I've put down more seats and I'm only allowed five. So, <laughs> so technically I failed. Because I added in all these extra seats. And I don't know why all of a sudden it just dawned on me right now. Because they've been here for a few episodes at this point. So, um, I'm just going to keep playing. I've, I'll get rid of them, but I'm just going to keep playing. So, <laughs> I just figured I'd point that out because I'm sitting here and I'm like, wow. Wow. So, there's that. But I'm going to I'm going to actually uh put me to bed. <laughs> this is right after uh well, this is a few days after, but um this is right after episode 24, so she never actually went to bed. So, I'm going to put her to bed, do all the things, and we will see you in the morning. Just figured I'd start with the blunder that is sitting right in front of us. And welcome back. Uh, it's morning now, so everything's good. She is about to get up. We have our work from home assignment, which is to harvest a flower, which I don't even know if we have. Um, I don't even know what she needs to do. She actually doesn't really need anything. So, um, but we are going to come downstairs and sell this painting that we made before we went to bed because we weren't like super tired in the morning. Uh, but we weren't super tired last night. And then um, we can make a uh, fruit salad for everybody. And then um, we'll come out, oh, we'll make a flower arrangement actually because uh, we have quite a bit of time to do that and it's only like 8.30, or I'm sorry, 8.50 in the morning. So we'll make this one. Um, and then, do we have flowers to har- Oh, we do. We can harvest these ones. Actually, we should probably just harvest all. Well, I want to sell all the garlic because we have enough garlic. We don't need to. I think if we just click that one, and then we can hit harvest all on the rest of them. So, B's gonna- Oh, she's not making food apparently. Not the end of the world. So, last episode, we finally kissed our last person that we need. So now, we need to go, we need to earn gold on three dates, and we need to have, have, we need to have two more boyfriends or girlfriends. So, I feel like we've done poor Ricky wrong, and we should ask him on a date... We'll have it right here at the house and we will just show him that we do truly love him and that he is our favorite boyfriend out of all of our boyfriends. And then we will go on to meet two more people and bring them on dates, hopefully, and everything will be fine. Which, in all honesty, will end up hurting Ricky's feelings in the beginning, but I think that if we ask Ricky on a date first, um, it might be better, so... We're gonna get this stuff done, we're gonna get on with our day, and then we'll take Ricky out on a date. So I will catch you when we're about to talk to Ricky. So, um, actually, while we were out here doing all of our stuff, um, B found one of our boyfriends, actually. He's the mail carrier. So we're going to ask him on a date instead, <laughs> um, and maybe we'll save Ricky for last. So, uh... So we'll go on a date with him right here at our home so we don't go anywhere without anybody else and get a gold date. So we need to talk ten times with our, our dude, ask about his day. We'll discuss gourmet dishes. I don't know why... We're so focused. Um. 
I don't want to say goodbye to these people. I don't know who these people are. I don't want to shower in the rain. I don't want to shower in the rain. I want to discuss interests with Corbin. I want to have a deep conversation with Corbin. We need to be flirty. Express fondness. We're both focused, so I don't know how well this is going to work. Oh, uh, we can kiss in the rain. That would be cute. We can embrace. Hold hands. Oh, now Jaden is... Uh, we want to woohoo in the hot tub. That would probably actually, um, make us both pretty flirty all at once. <laughs> and they like, yes? Is this a thing that's happening? Oh. Goodness, everybody is just out here. I, this dude isn't even... Oh, no, that's Ricky. <laughs> I was going to say, I don't know who that dude is. That's Ricky. They're going to woohoo. Everything's going to be great. Hopefully, they'll both be flirty afterwards. Oh, they're like, ah! <laughs> Jaden's like, no, no! Who? <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> there she goes. Oh, Lord. Can you do it now? Yes! Huh, oh, yes! We did it. We did it. We don't need to worry about anything else, so... B is hungry. So we're going to... Um, what is this? Um, we're going to eat this, I guess. We still have to find two more people to woo. Which is probably not that dude. Oh, which is probably not Jaden. Who are you? We've not met this dude. So let's meet this dude. Let's go, B. Move that body. Ooh, level 9 of the charisma skill. Look at B go. Yeah, you... You eat those chips. Um, ask about love life. Ask if single. It's a very important question. Ask a single. You didn't really ever answer that question, buddy. Okay, put that away for a minute. This is not ask a single. I want to know if this boy is single. Oh, there's our... Nope. That's a teen. Just kidding. He's single! Let's move in. Hit him with that sexy pose. Claim to be a criminal mastermind. Let's flirt. Whoa, whoa. Why are you, like, no knowing us? We'll confess our attraction. We can compliment his appearance. We can have our first kiss. We can flirt. Oh, there she goes. She hit him with that sexy pose and then hit him with that first kiss. That is the way to go, B. Let's ask on date because we still have time in this day. Asylum challenge. I hate the TV one. Ask to be boyfriend. Say, would you like to be my boyfriend? Oh, she's out walking naked. 
<laughs> yes, be our boyfriend. Okay. We need to talk to our date ten times. We need to flirt with our date. Oh, propose. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, thank you. Uh, we need to kiss our date. Kiss in the rain. Does that count? The Festival of Light. We probably will not go to that. Oh, gosh. That propose button comes up a little too, a little too much for my liking. We'll flirt. Yep, that did count. Give your date a massage. Oh, wow, we gotta sit down for that. Yes! We're done. We're done. Ending the date. Get that gold. Where is... Did we miss out on Father Winter? I bet we missed out on Father Winter. Is he upstairs? For some odd reason? No. We missed out pfft, on Father Winter. But I believe we could call him. I believe we could call him. Can we send texts to Father Winter? Oh my gosh, yes we can. We may actually be able to be done with this today. This this actually would be perfect because this is episode 25. That's a very nice number to end at. Um, I think I think we can power through and do it. We really honestly, we just need... If Father Winter could come back, we could ask him to be our boyfriend like right off the bat. And then we can see about taking Ricky on our last date. And we could, we could be done. We could... Th that would be it. We'll then tally up our points and see how, see how we did. I don't think that, oh, can I? <gasps> can I just do it like that? Oh my gosh, if I could ask, oh my gosh, I could just ask Father Winter on a date. That'd get him over here, right? I understand it's like 10 at night, but, oh, bye Corbin. <laughs> Who are you? Who are you? Oh. Uh, apparently we have loved you. Are you our girlfriend? <laughs> yep, because the propose comes up. So I imagine that uh, she's one of our girlfriends. Okay, but let's go. By the time you end up calling Father Winter and asking him on a date, it's gonna be midnight. Did he say yes? Oh, Genesis is walking through the house naked. No big deal. No big deal. Can we clean this up? No. We have mud fight, though. There's Jaden. Is that Jaden? Oh, there's Jaden. Jaden. Milo. Oh my gosh, not Jaden. Oh, here we go, too. We're gonna be... Shower in the rain. We don't need to do that. You can clean up these. Put some clothes on! Oh my lord. Goodness be goodness. Well, I think that we've had a pretty successful day, so we're going to go to bed. Oh, there goes Genesis. I This mud puddle is one of the best things here, I think. Uh, um, But yeah, we're all... <laughs> they're all naked outside. We'll go to bed for the night, and tomorrow morning we can get our last boyfriend... Or girlfriend. We can go on our last date. It will be beautiful and awesome and wonderful. We'll do our job. We'll tally up our points. And we'll get all of the good things. So I will see you guys in the morning. It's 4.30 in the morning. 
Hector's reached gardening level two. B's gonna get up. She's feeling inspired, apparently. And we need to do these things. She's gonna go downstairs and paint. I guess that she can go downstairs and paint. But really, we... Let... Hector's already our boyfriend. Ricky. We need to ask Ricky on a date. And I feel like he's gonna say no. Oh. Can I not ask him on a date? We need to come out here and embrace him. We're gonna fix things with Ricky. We did Ricky wrong. Oh, he says no, no. She's like, please. Just love me. We'll flatter him. We'll brighten his day. We'll discuss his mood. We'll ask him about his day. Oh, Hector is very dirty. We can get to know. We can ask about holding his hands, maybe. Hit him with that flirt. We might not be able to come back from him not liking us. We're focused now, apparently. I don't know what's outside that's making us focus. Ooh, he says. I don't. Unfortunately, I don't think this is going to work. So, the only other thing that we can do is see if we can ask him on a date this way. Which it looks like it's a no. So, I unfortunately am going to toss Ricky out. I don't know if she's our girlfriend, but she's got pretty low stuff. I really want Father w Father Winter would be the best one because he's I know that he's not our boyfriend. I'm pretty sure that I'm pretty sure that we just woohooed in the shower but did not make him our boyfriend. And it's not showing up if he's coming over or not. What are you doing? Maybe we can just invite him to hang out on our lot. How about that? He's probably like, it's 6.30 in the morning. Why are you calling me? Yeah, I see he's sleeping. Huh? What are we going to do with Ricky? Chat with Ricky? I don't think Ricky... Oh, oh, Ricky just got eaten. Um, we should probably feed these guys. She's like, come here. Essence of stress. <laughs> oh. Let's apply our mite treatment to our bees. We're embarrassed from an awkward encounter, probably from Ricky. Uh, let's do that really cool thing called, uh, Tent Garden. We'll get our job here in a minute. Well, it's New Year's Eve. I don't know if we necessarily work today. Uh, we can make a New Year's resolution so we can, uh, do the thing. Let's, let's complete an aspiration because that's what we're, we're aiming for. We're hoping that today... We do it. We're going to be done. It's going to be awesome and great and wonderful. Also, I just see that this naked gnome is out here, and I wonder if that's why everybody gets naked. <laughs> I know that it's not, but it's kind of funny that it's a thing. What do we need to do? We need a party spirit. Oh, and we need a countdown to midnight. Let's finish this painting. And, um... Somebody just... He's doing his thing. We'll finish this painting, and then um, we'll try to give Father Winter a call. Uh, maybe afterwards, we'll we'll do a flower arrangement as well. We'll do our job, and then we'll call Father Winter. See 
if he'll come over, if we can ask him to be our boyfriend, if we can gold star that date, and then we'll, honestly we'll be done. If Father Winter won't come over, we'll have to find somebody random on the street to woo, ask to be our lover, and then take them out on a date. So, it's very doable, but I'd, it'd be kind of nice if Father Winter was our last one since Ricky cannot be. Okay, we've gotten a lot of our stuff done. We're going to invite Father Winter one more time to come hang out on our lot. We'll see if it works. And if not, we're just going to have to go track down some rando on the street and do in all of the things. I don't know why we're walking back to the bathroom to call Father Winter. Bye, here we are. Yes, come over, Father Winter. Yes. You come out here, B. We'll wait for him. We can also, um, super sell. Oh, we're out here <gasps> waiting for him. Romance. Ask to be boyfriend, Father Winter. Where do you think you are going? Excuse you. Oh. Okay, apparently. Um, he's all the way over here. And now her arm is weird. We're gonna ask him on a date. <laughs> Okay, everything's fine. Everything's fine. So, we did it. We have a boyfriend. We just need to woo him into a gold for our date. And oh my gosh, we're going to be done, guys. Oh my gosh, we're going to be done. Sit together. Sit together. Do it. Sit together. Sit, Father Wonder. Sit. Well, this will count for this one. There we go. Joke with our date. Tell a dirty joke. Let's... Oh, this is not the one I wanted. Tell a funny story. Um, and then... Let's... Oh, that's not what I want. Oh, that's not what I want. Oh, a joke about penguins. And then sit together. Milo, leave. This is this is what's going to be the difference between me getting silver and gold. Have deep conversations with your date. Can we do it with just this? Friendly. Ask about day just to keep him here because I don't want him to leave. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa. Whoa. Sit together. Sit. Sit. Father Winter, sit. No, Genesis. No, Genesis. No, Genesis. No. Father Winter, sit on this couch with me. Sit on this couch. No, Jaden! No, Jaden! Sit together. Okay, we're gonna find this deep conversation. Deep conversation! Deep conversation! Another. Deep conversation. No. Oh my gosh, this is not gonna work. Oh no, no, no. This is horrible. This was our last one. Yes. <gasps> no, we did it. Oh my gosh, we did it. We did it. We did it. Look at this. Boom. Ending early. End date. Third one. Aspiration achieved. Yes. Glorious music of finishing an aspiration and we're done. Beatrice has looked for love in all the right places and achieved her dream of becoming a romantic
connoisseur. She's now a player and she will never cause jealousy. We did a resolution. We got a reward. We're done, guys. We're done. Done, done, done. So, scoring. So, I would like to point out that I did, in the beginning of this episode, I did say it, but I did put down those extra seats. I did not realize what I had done at the time. It technically broke the rules. I understand that. Um, we're not going on a date with Corbin. I'm sorry. We're done, Corbin. We're done. Um, so, take it as you will. I don't think anybody ever slept out there. I just, I feel like an idiot because I placed those things down and I should have thought about the challenge rules. So, what is B doing? B's just hanging out. So, I'm going to tally up all of our points and um, we'll be done at the end, but that's how it all works. So, I do get the negative 20 for the power, um, but we never had a fire and we never had a sim die. So, I feel like we did pretty well. So guys, that is it for the Asylum Challenge. We made it for 25 episodes. We nailed it. Uh, in total, I got 403 points. I will link the um, Asylum Challenge rules and the scoring guide that I used in the description below. Um, I lost 20 points for <laughs> B. I lost 20 points for the, for the stuff that I missed. And B earned us 89 points in total because she got skill points for all of the things that she did. Plus, she has 10,000 satisfaction points. So, she absolutely killed it. She has graduated from the asylum and she can now go live her life the way she wants to live. So, thank you guys so much for watching this series. I had such a fun time doing this. I'm excited i've already made my black widow sim who will be in my next challenge let's play um so i'm looking forward to doing that i'm hoping that you'll join me on that wild ride as well but again thank you guys so much for watching this episode if you liked it why don't you leave me a like if you have something to say why don't you leave it in the comments below and if you really liked it you can always subscribe to my channel so you never miss a video We'll start off with the Black Widow challenge here in a couple of weeks, and I cannot wait to start killing all of these sims. So, thank you again, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!